Leaders for the National Social Investment Programs in all 36 states and the Federal Capital Territory have met with the Minister of Humanitarian Affairs, Disaster Management and Social Development. The interactive session is to assess the impact of the program in the country and its challenges through the experience shared by these coordinators. This is part of activities to commemorate the one-year anniversary of the ministry. Mugo Tomas reports. Social investment programs were created to tackle poverty and hunger across the country. The initiative is to help actualize President Buhari's plans to bring 100 million Nigerians out of poverty within 10 years. But the programs to date have been one of the most criticized policies of this administration, with many questioning its impact. The state coordinators of the program believe otherwise and argue that the projects have alleviated poverty within their domains. We have a lot of success stories. The import of their argument is not lost on the Minister of Communication and Digital Economy, Issa Pantami, who agrees that the initiative portrays the agenda of the administration. We all admit that no administration will be successful without fighting poverty. Social investment program being championed by Haji Asadia Omar Farouk, the minister, is a declaring of war on poverty in this country. That the National Assembly, especially the Senate, and definitely probably the House of Representatives will give you all the necessary support you need to continue, especially on the aspect of poverty eradication. And power with 549,500 beneficiaries, homegrown school feeding program, 9,963,726 beneficiaries, conditional cash transfer, 408,682 beneficiaries, enterprise and empowerment program, recorded 2,238,334 beneficiaries. According to the minister, the buy-in by state governors have helped saw the success of the programs. By year 2021, we'll see these programs being expanded in the budgetary allocation. I am optimistic that we can and will make a difference in the lives of poor and socially vulnerable Nigerians. The four arms of the project is to ensure a more equitable distribution of resources to the very poor and vulnerable in the society. It has so far supported over 4 million beneficiaries in the country. Moya Thomas, CVC News, Abuja.